planning a new look for Sydney's Northwest Rail Link with massive car parks and possibly two extra stations. It's promised the project will go ahead with or without federal help. And we should know the cost later this year. Unlike all the announcements of the Northwest Rail Link since 1998, there were no expensive computer animations or rent a crowd in hard hats. The new Transport Minister was on her own making a simple pledge. This plan will work because we've done our homework and we are doing our homework. The latest incarnation will run 23 kilometres through six new stations from Epping to Rouse Hill. Step one, geotechnical surveys. To see what the status of the earth is underground, to see what equipment you'll need to actually make this project happen. In Castle Hill, they liken the project to the Loch Ness Monster. Years of talk, no sightings. I don't believe it anymore. <laughs> Why is that? It, it goes on and on and on for years. It depends on the money too, whether they can raise the money. We don't blame the public for being cynical. Under 16 years of labour, this was announced and acts so many times. I think everybody in New South Wales wants to see the government get a wriggle on. We've it's hoped federal funding will allow the Epping, Parramatta and North West lines to be built at the same time. By the time these projects are finished, Epping will be the new central station of the North West, with lines branching out to Chatswood, Hornsby, Rouse Hill, Parramatta and Strathfield. And to go with all the new stations, there'll be an extra 3,000 car spaces. Most of the land needed has already been secured. Adam Walters, 7 News. Thousands